welcome back in. I'm with Dr. Dave Shetler, and we've got fungus among us. <laughs> <laughs> well, this year especially, if you don't have fungi, something's wrong in your yeah. yard. <laughs> yeah. So, so what are the conditions? Uh, there's a thing called the disease triangle. <laughs> Explain what how that relates to what we've got here in well, the yard and and, and and the proliferation of uh, uh, fungal diseases this year. Okay. Well, in the disease triangle, they're talking about fungal pathogens, something that might attack your plants or, or something like that. Dollar spot. And, red right. thread. This, and in, this. in the disease triangle, number one, you got to have the disease. You got to have the organism there, but you have to have food and water, habitat for it, uh, and, and the right environment uh, for that. And this year we've had the right environment. In this particular case, these are what we consider to be benign fungi, but I consider them to be useful fungi because this is a fungus in which the mycelium are eating the thatch, the decaying organic matter in, the that's in your lung. The mycelium is kind of the growing body it's of... the actual fungus itself. This okay. is the fruiting body. The, okay. When, when it decides to be sexy, uh, <laughs> it, it, will, it will pop up. Okay. Uh, and on the underside of this cap, uh, it will produce spores, and those spores will float around again and try to find again at the right moisture, the right temperature, and the right environment with organic matter. And if it's moist again, pop back up again. So these, I consider them beneficial. You, you don't have to worry about them. Uh, they're going to, in the hot sun, melt on down. But if you just mow them off, that would be fine also. It's not going to hurt. And if no. somebody was really concerned about them, really they could just knock them over and they'll dry up. Yep, absolutely. Um, I get the question a lot. Uh, from folks to ID their their the mushrooms in their yard, <laughs> and I will say I think I know what that is, but I always say. I never eat a mushroom that's grown in my yard. There's only about three experts that I consider here in Ohio that I would trust that I go out with and they say that's edible and that's not edible. But even with that said, I find that there are some mushrooms that produce things that each individual person can react to. And so they might give you an upset stomach or a headache or something like that. They may not kill you, but you certainly, uh, so I buy my mushrooms in that package uh, or in the store. Yeah, I like Kroger's as well. <laughs> or Whole Foods or wherever, right, right. yeah, wherever. <laughs> All right, so there you have it. Fungus Among Us, how you can treat it. A little bit more information about that. Dave, thanks for joining us sure. this morning. Check back often for your garden. I'm Tom Wood.